couple of things that we need to point out. First of all, I have been told that LeBron James and his camp have absolutely positively nothing to do with this story. This is strictly coming from the Golden State Warriors. They are an ultra-aggressive franchise. When nobody thought they'd have a shot at Kevin Durant, they were way ahead of the curve, and they set the foundation a year in advance to acquire Kevin Durant. Now they're putting out feelers to see if they'd have a shot at LeBron James. This is not LeBron James and his camp. This is the Warriors and their camp putting out this story because they're an ultra-aggressive franchise who will never less rest on its laurels. Now, knowing the Golden State Warriors the way that I do, you know, Joe, Joe Lakeup and, and, and Myers and, and Steve Kerr and the crew, that definitely is the kind of thing that they would do. They are forward thinkers. They are aggressors. They do not stand pat. They do not sit oddly by and rest on their laurels. So it is certainly plausible that this is coming from them. Having said that, let me be very, very clear to LeBron James. If you even think about going to the Golden State Warriors, your legacy is tarnished forever. It can't, it, there's no other way around it. There's no other way. You cannot be a team, you cannot be the best player in the world that has had a stacked deck that wins three championships, the latest in Cleveland after ending a drought that lasted more than a half century in that city. You've lost two of the last three championships to the Golden State Warriors, and then you turn around and you decide to join them, no matter how great Kevin Durant is, and he is phenomenal, it doesn't take away from the fact that at the time he left, it was the weakest move that I'd ever seen by a superstar. If LeBron goes to the Warriors, nothing, and I do mean nothing, will eclipse that in terms of weakness by a superstar. Absolutely, positively nothing. You can go to Houston. You can go a lot of different places. You can go back to Miami with D-Way. You can stay in Cleveland. All right? Damn it, you can go to the nation's capital. Okay? You can do whatever you got to do. You can't go to the Golden State Warriors if LeBron James goes to the Golden State Warriors. If LeBron James has a meeting with the Warriors, he'll be vilified for that. If you saw him having a cup of coffee with the Warriors, he'd have a problem with that.